If you guys think that Brittany should try this goat milk with me, <laughs> comment down below. Oh, comment. Yes. Take you guys to our favorite store. Grocery store. Grocery okay, store. Guys, this is not your typical grocery store. For any of you outside of Utah, this is gonna be a treat because we are gonna share with you our favorite grocery store here in Utah. But it's so much more than just a grocery store. It's heaven on earth. For instance, right now we're sitting in like this little cafe lounge area up above where you actually shop. Which is really, really cool. Which is so so cool. Top level is like a cafe, so during the lunchtime, it is packed in here with all the business people coming in to get lunch. They eat up here, people do business meetings up here. It's just really, really cool. They even have a cooking school up in the top I of know. this store, which is really, really cool. Yeah, that might cool. be kind of fun if we did a cooking class here. Ooh, yeah. Comment down below if you guys would like to just do a cooking class here at Harmon's. That could be really fun. That could be a lot of fun. I'm actually curious, have any of you guys taken a cooking class anywhere? I never have. But you guys, I did have to say, do you notice anything different about me? Oh, yeah. <laughs> you have little grays in your hair. Sure. <laughs> <laughs> no. <gasps> you guys, my earring. I still can't get over the fact that I have my ears pierced. I know, they look so, so good. Fun. They seriously look so good. And you guys, I'm taking really good care of them. So many of you guys commented that I needed to make sure I was cleaning them and keeping the earrings in for the amount of time they tell me. And don't worry, I will, because I'm not gonna have the same thing happen where it rips through again. If any of you guys are new to our channel and do not know what we're talking about, and you're thinking, why is this girl talking about her pierced <laughs> ears? She's like 30 and she's talking about pierced ears. It's because I just got my ears pierced in yesterday's vlog and we had a really fun day. So make sure you go check out that video. Daryl will link it in the description below. But it was really weird sleeping with them again. You can't take them out. So I was like trying to like get comfortable, not like having the back pierced into my neck. I know. She was but, like kind of complaining. So I just made sure to put in some earplugs and just I don't around. Not complaining. <laughs> she wasn't. I was just kidding. I didn't say one word. <laughs> Anyways. So guys, we need to pick up some groceries, but more importantly, we are getting dinner here. They have the most amazing salad bar you will ever oh, see in your life. So Soup, good. Salads, baked goods, everything you can think of. There's like a Chinese Unfortunately, food. they charge by the pound. <laughs> so my salad ends up being like $57. There's a funny story I'll tell you later about that. Let's get to shopping and we'll show you around. type of salad you can think of. How delicious does this look? Different types of pasta salads, everything you can think of. This is a quinoa salad, that's one of our favorites. Jared loves their pasta salads. Now one thing I noticed you guys is that when Brittany does the cooking, sometimes I find these Harmons like <laughs> wrappers and stuff, containers in the trash. <laughs> that is not true. <laughs> Pulling a Mrs. Doubtfire on us, are ya? Hey. Home cooked meal. I'm like, hey, honey. You guys, grilled chicken, veggies, potatoes. You put this on a plate, pop it in the oven. It's like, oh, Jared, dinner's ready. It's perfect. <laughs> just kidding. No, Brittany does make amazing home cooked stuff. I was just teasing, but this is like but our go to place. Yeah, we do get a ton of their pre made meals here. It's like Costco times 100, I feel like. Oh, so they have good. So many different varieties. They have different sizes. So, say if it's just for the two of us, we can get a size. It would be just two, but then they have big family sizes as well, which is really cool. Yeah, so good.
they have the most amazing cheese selection you will ever see here. Like, yeah, it's legit. Any type of cheese, this is the place. Check it out. As we mentioned earlier, is their salad bar. It's not your typical salad bar. It's not just lettuce and you would think typical things that you put in a salad. They have four, yes, four of the big salad bar stands, double-sided. You guys, this is homemade Chinese food. So you pick up a box and then you can make your own Chinese to-go container. How cool is that? In the grocery store. We're gonna get some stuff for dinner. We'll kind of show you the variety because there is so much to choose from. But guess what? A lot of it's healthy, which is good. classify this as a salad, I need a few shreds of lettuce. <laughs> and by few, he literally means two. Oh my gosh, Jerry. <laughs> salad. Done. <laughs> salad. <laughs> already spiraled zucchini, squash, beets, carrots, veggies, diced, everything you can think of. This is a fajita blend of veggies, so you can just grab that, pick up some chicken and some seasoning. And I love how they're portioned for cooking, so you don't have a ton of wasted food. It's just perfect for whatever meal you're making. One of my favorite things about this place is that they have cold pressed juices here. And no joke you guys, they literally make the best cold pressed juices. We had one yesterday of just orange juice and it was like a gallon. I finished the entire thing in less than 24 hours. Yeah, I didn't get any. <laughs> But we were just talking to the guy that works here. So they make these pressed juices every morning, you guys. This one's a watermelon mint. Like, how good does that oh, sound? I cannot wait. You guys, Jared just got super excited. Babe, what did you find? This is fresh ground peanut butter. How cool is that? Just right here. This is awesome. So guys, they have really awesome fresh meat counter where you can get all your meats. They have an awesome bakery. Seriously, we can shop here every single day. We can eat here every single day. Oh, so seriously. Fun. Comment down below, you guys. We want to hear what your favorite grocery stores are. Or if you live here in yeah. Utah, do you like Harmons? And I'm curious, outside of Utah or in other countries, do you guys have grocery stores similar to this where they have a ton of just fresh made food that you can go and pick up? Yeah, seriously, we would love to know that. So definitely comment down below. That's one of our favorite things is just learning about different places, seeing other places, and how you guys shop too. Yeah, seriously, because we travel quite a bit and if we could go to a Harmon's likes grocery store when we travel, maybe in heaven. I know over in Europe, when I lived over in Switzerland, I know they had a ton of places like this, but in a lot of places you had to go to like a bakery and then you go to the meat shop, you go to a cheese shop, you go to each little shop to pick up their specialty, which is also super fun.
All right, you guys, I know this is gonna come across a little funny, but one of my favorite types of milks to drink is actually goat milk. They don't have the brand that I typically get, but I am gonna give this one a shot. If you guys like goat milk too, definitely comment down below because Brittany always teases me that I like goat milk, but I think it tastes so good. The funny thing though is, is that Brittany has actually never tried goat milk. Ew, no. <laughs> if you guys think that Brittany should try this goat milk with me, comment down below. I'll comment yes, down below. yes. Let's get as many comments as we possibly can. Let's do a petition to get Brittany to drink the goat milk. You know what we should do? We should do a milk taste test and have like almond milk, goat milk, soy milk, regular milk, all those kind of milk, and see if we can tell the difference. That could kind of be fun. I actually totally agree with that. I think it'd be a lot of fun. If you guys think that's fun too, I know this is a lot of comments for milk. Comment down below for that as well. We're just so inspired by the grocery store, you guys. <laughs> I know it sounds kind of cheesy, but we love going grocery shopping together. It's like a fun date night. We get to pick out, obviously, food, which is so fun. But then we just get to spend time with each other and joke around a lot. Guys, I actually have a quick funny story about buttermilk. So when I was in high school, I was staying at my buddy's house and his dad comes up to me. He's like, have you ever tried buttermilk before? And I was like, no, I have never tried it before. He's like, oh, you gotta try it. It tastes like a malt. And I was thinking, oh, malts taste so good. Anyway, so he poured me a big, tall glass of buttermilk, and here I am thinking it's gonna taste like a vanilla malt. Oh my gosh. If you guys have ever tried buttermilk before, it is super bitter, it does not taste good at all. And I immediately was just like, oh, I don't like this. So I went to go pour it out because I knew he was teasing me. And then my friend's dad stopped me and he said, oh, no, 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 we don't waste anything in this house. He's like, you're gonna finish the whole glass. Power nap. Long story short, I finished it. It was disgusting. We're gonna show you one of our favorite types of yogurt. Who has tried the Chobani flips? So basically what it is, if you don't know what these are, there's yogurt in one little compartment, and then there's the toppings in the other, and you flip it, and then you mix it. This one's one of my favorite. It's the key lime pie. I feel like yogurt is a really good, if you're ever craving something sweet but don't want to eat a big dessert, this right here is your go-to. been watching our vlogs know that I'm a sucker for good smelling laundry and so I just picked up some scent boosters this one's downy you just throw a few of them in with your wash and your laundry comes out smelling so so good speaking of cleaning products and things we are out of hand soap and we love the Myers hand soap I feel like it doesn't leave your hands super dry it's more moisturizing and they have a ton of different scents that smell really good favorite snacks they are the Ritz toasted chips this one's sour cream and onion that's one of our favorite but they are oven baked so they're supposed to be a little bit healthier than just regular potato chips Jared they are that's what we tell ourselves but they're on sale for two for six dollars so we're definitely gonna pick up two of these one hour later all right guys we just got back home we ate dinner it was absolutely delicious for kind of everyday things we don't always go to Harmon's because it is a little bit on the pricier side so for things like that, we usually go to Walmart, Target, places like that. But Harmon's for really like yummy food and specialty things, that is kind of our little treat. Before we say goodbye, we have not done our fam faves in a while, which- I know, it's been too long. I know, we've missed doing that. So we are going to do that right now. For any of you who are new to our channel, we do something called fam faves, where we go and we highlight one of you by going through our the comments left on our latest videos. And we just like reading them, highlighting letting you guys because if it wasn't for you guys we wouldn't be doing this at all so we love 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 reading yeah, your comments we love and interacting this. with you this is a lot of fun for us to do this this is on yesterday's video with us getting my ears pierced my fam fave is from miss evelyn jackson she said the girls are so sweet they really enjoy the time with you both i can't wait for you to have a child of your own you would be great parents god bless all of you <laughs> so sweet thank you evelyn yeah thank you evelyn that's way sweet of you p.s i've always thought evelyn was like the prettiest name ever so i love your name <laughs> <laughs> and my fan fave is katie lupton katie says i love seeing how special you made the girls feel you're going to be wonderful parents <laughs> oh so sweet <laughs> thank, you, thank katie. you katie and thank you everyone seriously we had so many comments on that video especially towards 
me and getting my ears pierced saying like you were so brave and they look great and all that you guys are just so, so yeah you sweet. guys are seriously amazing thank you very much i did see quite a few comments saying did it hurt so no you guys it did not hurt i think it just scared me more than anything i had it built up in my mind <laughs> but as soon as the gun went in it was so quick it felt like a little pinch and it was over so and today they're doing fine they're not like red or swollen or anything which is a good sign yeah they look good next we're heading over to instagram at jared and Britt. if you're not following us head over there we just posted the cutest picture of hazy ava and i seriously <laughs> yeah. so so super cute. cute our fam fave over on that is miss kareen felice and she said just seeing how excited the girls were to spend time with you guys it's the little moments like this that create the best memories so <laughs> sweet we asked what everyone's favorite part of the vlog was and that was her response so thank you so much kareen yeah thank you very very much that's very sweet of you and to all of you guys that commented again thank you so much we love reading your guys comments it's like the highlight of our day and so thank you for leaving them it's the best thing ever i love it <laughs> i get home from work and i just love reading all the comments if you aren't already Already subscribed to our channel hit that subscribe button hit the notification bell because you guys we are trying to post a lot and you don't want to miss out on any of it we have a lot of exciting things coming up oh, especially yeah. this week we may even have an update for you on where we are with our house situation which will be really exciting that's probably our most asked question right now <laughs> that we get all the time from you so we do have an update for you where we're at there plus we have some surprises coming up one that's so top secret that not many people know about it we love you. Thank you for tuning in and being part of our family. And we will see you next time. See you guys. Love you. Bye. Bye.